ik ga nu beginnen met episode 2. Check it. I'm not big on speeches. I've always believed that the role of the bartender is to shut up and listen. And by that measure, Gabe was the worst bartender I've ever known. I never issued a speeding ticket to someone on a bicycle before until he came along. He cared so much about my admissions essay. Even though he probably couldn't spell admissions <laughs> or essay. <laughs> he booked my band to play the lantern all the way from Seattle to pretty much right where I'm standing. I can recall 14 specific instances where Gabe said something that made me laugh. <laughs> the first was two years ago. So, long story short, instead of a ticket, I ended up buying him a beer. Gabe stood like three feet away, grinning like a doofus at us. I'm sure there were more people, but I only remember him. And then he said, I know, that's why the K is silent. <laughs> Then the fifth time... He cared about everyone. He was the kind of guy you wanted to be around. He was a world-class bullshitter. He was my best friend. say about Gabe is he came into this bar as a stranger but he left it as family <clears throat> guess that's that then what happened to Gabe was a senseless, tragic accident. And I just wish it that... It wasn't an accident. Son, now is not the time. Gabe called the mine. I gave him my sat phone to be sure he could get through. They fucked up. And now... Now Gabe's dead. That was my shift. If anyone had called, it would have gone through me. Nobody called. You're lying. <laughs> In front of Gabe's own fucking sister. Alex heard the whole thing. Oh my. Oh my, I don't know man. I don't know Well, I didn't... I didn't hear Gabe make the call. But he told us he got through. Well, if Gabe said something, then I'm inclined to believe him, Mac. What are you saying? Oh. I'm not saying anything. Just, I didn't get a call. Draw your own conclusions. 
All right, folks. This is an ongoing investigation. How about it? We review the sequence of events. Hmm? Well, son. When I saw you at the record store, you seemed pretty eager to find Gabe. Remember why? Hmm? Another fight with Riley, maybe? No, I don't have to take this. Just saying. Pretty wild that you come stumbling out of Gabe's apartment with your face all fucked up. Right. And just a couple hours later, you just so happened to miss the call that would have saved his life? Well, I told you there was no call to miss. And hey, maybe the call got dropped. Oh shit, I mean, it's not like, it's not like Gabe was Mr. Reliable all the time. You watch your mouth, Mac. Ryan, that's enough. Now, I'm just as eager as you to understand all this, son, but there was a time... Bullshit, Dad. This little weasel's calling Gabe a liar at his own fucking wake. No, I am just telling you. Mac, I swear, if you say there was no call one more fucking time... Stop it! Stop it now! This is not the time or place. We're all here for Gabe. Okay, Ryan? Sure, I'm... I'm sorry. It's not... I'm just... I'm not the one who killed him. <laughs> Aren't you, though? What the fuck oh, did my you just Abel. say? Ryan, back oh, off. My oh, hell. I'm just saying. I thought I heard that you were the one. You shut the hell up. No. No, go ahead. You got something to say, Mac? Let's okay, fucking hear it. Come on, guys. Oh, yeah. Don't make me intervene. All right. Fine. As long as we're tossing around accusations, way I hear it, you're the guy who cut the rope. Why not That's you? It. Wait's over. Everyone out. Alex? Hey. Fuck those guys. Yeah. Are you okay? God, no. I'm a fucking wreck. It's not your job to keep it together. Thanks. Do you... Um... It's messy, but... Do you want to come in? Sure. You play guitar? Sort of. It was a gift. From Gabe. Cool. Gabe would try to pop wheelies outside the record store to make me laugh. Never worked. Till he wiped out. That was hilarious. Gabe really wanted to do the art for Ethan. But by the end of it, he was more jazzed about it than anybody. Wish I could have seen it. Yeah. 
We took this a year ago. We... No way. I can't. What? He actually kept it. Whatever that bottle made her think of, it really messed her up. I wonder if I could help her the same way I helped Ethan. I need to feel her sadness to figure out how to help her. Charlotte's sculpture. I wonder how she's really holding up. One of the happiest memories I have. Thanks, Gabe. Love that Gabe was going to be part of a LARP. Would have been fun to see. Getting dressed shouldn't be so hard. And yet... Thanks, Jed. I feel sick. Hey, Shoo Shoo. Thanks for sticking around. Feels like a million years since that day with Gabe. It hasn't even been a week. Same. Living off these is not great. But it's better than leaving the apartment. And the knop om dingen te zien lukt niet voor rijden, dus naar haar toe. Foosball champion? Why would that make her so sad?
I can find out what's really going on with Steph. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting your new foosball champion, Gabe Chen. Oh, you're the worst. Can't believe I have to stay in this stupid town. I think we both know you could have beat me if you really wanted to. So you're welcome. Bullshit. Damn it, fucking overpowered blue meteor. Aww, <laughs> is your controller broken too? We're playing until I win. Then I'll be crashing here tonight. What are they called again? Don't shit on my yard! They're amazing! Their guitarist has one arm! Badass. Dude, give it up. I already booked a bus ticket. Wait, wait, hear me out. One more game. If I win, you have to stay. If you win, I'll cover the ticket. You just lost 50 bucks. Here's to your new job at the station. Oh, didn't I tell you? I'm not taking it. I move to Denver next week. You what? I think I know enough to help her now. Gabe really meant a lot to her. Still can't believe he's gone. Yeah. He's the whole reason I'm still... I'm sorry, Alex. Don't mind me. Wanna get a few matches of Dino Racer in? Could be a nice distraction. No thanks. I just need a minute. That didn't help. I could put on a record, if you like. Nah, not really in the mood. Maybe something else? Can I get you a drink or anything? No thanks. I appreciate the offer though. Sure. That wasn't right. How about a quick match? Did Gabe tell you we played? I just had a hunch. Yeah? Well, you're right. I don't really think it's a great time. Okay. First to five points? If you say so. You're a lot of winner, huh? So, so how often did you and Gabe play? It was one of our favorite games. You must be pretty good then. Mm hmm. You were in a band, right? Yeah. What'd you play? Drums. Oh my. How uh, how long did you play with them? <sighs> Too long. Gotcha.
Yes. Dan gaat het betere richting. Five points! That's game! Yep. Big shocker. Hey. Oh, hey, at least you played your best. I mean, that obviously wasn't my best. No. I get it. I mean, this is a tough game. It requires skill, timing, and the will to be a champion. Oh, is that how it is? Wait, hold on. Ja, ik toch, uh, bezig the crowd is really the picking character. up on my energy. You. I want a rematch. You're on. I'm actually trying this time, so you better focus. I am focusing. Good. Wouldn't want you to get distracted or anything. Certainly not. It is. I come up with the check. Greatest Northwest band of all time, go. <laughs> Are you trying to distract me? Oh, of course not. Slater Kinney, if you were wondering. Do one more game. I don't know. Oh, come on. You know Gabe would never let a tie stand. Well, then it's settled. <laughs> this is it. For all the marbles. So many marbles. Definitely the kind of game you want to focus on. No matter what happens. Totally. Hey, so are you into girls or what? <laughs> I mostly dated guys before, actually. Oh yeah? Do they listen to CDs of bird calls? Because I could hook you up. <laughs> Can't say I've ever dated a bird call enthusiast before. Who's what? How convinced were you that that was- Oh, oh fucking finally! <laughs> the house of Chen crumbles at last! <laughs> Good game. GG. Thank you. You're a much better loser than Gabe. That's no fun. Sorry to spoil the victory. So, what are you gonna do now? What do you mean? That shit with Mac. He's clearly lying, right? 
I'm not sure what Max Steele is. His story doesn't add up. Yeah. I do know that I need to find out exactly what happened that night. For myself and for Gabe. I've got your back. No matter what. Thank you. That means a lot. I should head back to work. Cool. Bye. Bye. I know Gabe made that call, but did Mac really let the blast go off just to get back at him? Oh, you act the I never got to see bartender Gabe in action, but he left some pretty big shoes to fill. I could probably use a little more practice. Would have been fun to see Gabe crush some sweet powder. Or whatever snowboarders say. <laughs> you served him well. At least I got to have a few good moments. One of the happiest memories I have. Thanks, Gabe. Gabe really meant the world to Steph. Gabe used to swat the controller out of my hands if he thought I was going to beat him. Jerk. Thank God for this thing. We'd never have found Ethan without it. It's a start. I just got him back. How can he be gone? The kind of person who got that worked up over a college essay be capable of almost anything. Feels like a million years since that day with Gabe. Hasn't even been a week. The answer, my friend, is blowing in the wind. I'll toss those soon, I swear. Why look up at the sky when you could look at a sculpture instead? No birds today. Gabe really loved this place. Gabe was such a dad. Oh yeah. If you could stay here too, I wouldn't try to stop you. Yeah, good. I'll be the only trans person in a town with a population of like four. That sounds like a blast for me. Thanks for not trying to stop me. I'm sorry, Izzy. It's not you. And it's not the band. I fucking love that shit. But I need to try this. It's just... time for something new. I knew it. I knew this would happen eventually. Fucking... see you around, Steph. 
time for something new. I know how that feels. I bet Gabe could even make golf fun. I thought this was going to be the one. Finally. Despite all the disappointments, I really let myself believe. I believed you completely. I let myself hope, really hope, for the first time in years. Even after I freaked out in front of you and hit you, you didn't push me away. You sat right there and told me that I wasn't broken, that I was special, and I belonged. Then you died, and I don't know what to believe now, except you're gone again, and I'm still here. Alone. No one could blame me for wanting to drink all my sorrows away. Who pays for their alcohol with a check? Oh wait, Gabe? Gabe. Look, I appreciate what you're trying to do for me, Mr. Lucan, but I'm not staying long. And I don't take handouts. Just, maybe don't cash that check like, right now. I think Gabe had more fun at his job than anyone. I wonder what Gabe's favorite track on here was. Jet definitely has a decorating style. I'd call it steakhouse. They look happy together. RM and TB. I wonder who they were. Things got pretty heated back there.
Oh, hey, kid, you don't have to do that. Too late. Wanted to apologize for all of us. We're all grieving, but that's no excuse. It was your brother's wake, and you both deserve better than listening to a bunch of fools squabble. I appreciate it. That was pretty rough. Although it's hard to imagine a good version of your dead brother's wake. No, there's no good version. Just all of us trying to get through it together the best we can. It wasn't the first wake held in this old building. I doubt it'll be the last. Anyway, if there's anything I can do, just let me know. I need to talk to Mac. I know he's lying. I just don't know why. Any idea where I can find him? Well, he helps out Eleanor at the flower shop. That'd be the place to start. Thanks. I feel like I should warn you, though. You might not get the kind of closure you're looking for. If you get any at all. Just... Don't pin all your hopes on Mac Loudon. Thanks for looking out for me, but what else am I supposed to do? I wish I had an answer for you. But if you get a chance before you go all dirty, Harry, swing by the dispensary. Charlotte wants to see you. And one more thing. I've been meaning to give you this for the last few days, but I didn't want to disturb you up there. It'll get you through that door, and the one upstairs. This is your home now, for as long as you'd like. What about rent? I don't want to be a freeloader. Don't worry about that for right now. We'll work out a way for you to earn your keep when the time comes. Thank you. Give him hell. <laughs> okay. I... I have no idea what to even say to him. Gabe would be up here a lot if he wasn't the one taking the pictures. Gabe would have appreciated having beer at his wake. I should put something here. It's the least I can do. Gabe Chen, smooth criminal. I wish we'd had more time. They must have been close. Poor Ethan. I hope Ducky didn't finish this by himself. Courtesy of Haven's favorite DJ, I bet. Okay, what? Maybe I can find something upstairs to put on the memory table. Oh, okay. If I never saw mining equipment ever again, it'd be too soon. Nobody needed this. Forecast called for rain, but the skies have been clear. I had an incredible mom, and I decided I wanted to be a ranger. She was the first person I told. She said, she said, 
You sure exactly what these mountains need. Bye, Mom. Would have been fun to let Gabe kick my ass at pool. Why do I feel like this is a challenge? I'll spend the rest of my life wondering what would have happened if Ryan hadn't cut that rope. I bet he will too. This town has a long memory. Guess it's nice to know that Gabe won't be forgotten. Wonder what I can find up here to add to Gabe's memory table. Oh, Lane Auburn. No. So long, depression food. This is perfect for the memory table. See? I can be a person. Clean home, clean mind. Right, Dr. Lin? Glad I have something to add to Gabe's table. A fun, goofy album. I've only known Jed a few days, but he's got my back better than any care worker ever did. Hopefully, things around here can settle down again. Yeah, that'd be good. Okay, Jed said I might find Mac in the flower shop, but I have time to swing by the dispensary if I want.
Okay, the dispensary. Yeah. I can meme up. On one hand, there's the open road and the freedom to run away from my problems. On the other, helmet hair. Was it on the news? No, no one's been fired. Yet. I wonder how many fish Ducky's caught in this thing. Oh, wait, I don't know. Do I even want to stay here without Gabe? In this state I've never been to before. This town I've been in for less than a week. Not that I know where else I'd even go. Back to the nothing waiting for me in Portland. Fuck. I have no idea what comes next. But I'm not leaving here without answers about Gabe. At least I know that. I wonder if I am dreaming. Everything feels so strange now. Under this open town sky. I wonder if there's still me. The park looks fun to explore. If not for the paddling, kayaking would be super relaxing. This is cool. In a wicker man sort of way. I don't think this whole town is a pagan cult. Too bad I can't just run away from all this. Oh. He looks so alone. Everyone needs to stop telling me it's okay. It's not. Fuck. Losing Gabe's been hard enough for a supposed grown-up like me. But for Ethan... Hey, buddy. Hey, Alex. Do you... want to talk about it? I'm fine. Okay. Definitely not mine. I'm here for you, whenever you need me. This is awful. He was so young. He must be reading about Gabe. At this point, I wouldn't be surprised if the Spring Festival ends with a ritual sacrifice. What if I'm secretly a total prodigy at disc golf, but never had the chance to find out? Probably for the best, honestly. This location gets all the foot traffic. And word around the water cooler is, the mining company is about to expand. More jobs means more customers for you. What about that accident? Frankly, I'm a little spooked. If Typhon goes under, I'd lose all my business. It's very unlikely that anything with Typhon will change. They've been the largest- Oh, customers here are a lot nicer than in Denver. Never been to Denver, but I guarantee they're nice here. Yeah. It's bullshit. 
We have a right to know what's happening to our jobs. You guys don't think anything's really gonna change, right? It's hard to say. Yeah, because they won't tell us a damn thing. I keep Typhon eight years of my life, and they can't give me back one simple answer about my job. Typhon doesn't give a shit about anyone. I just still can't wrap my head around it. Someone died? It's a shit to... Wind chimes. The original jam band. One doctor had me try meditation. I always just fell asleep. Sorry. Might be a good time to check out the dispensary. Jed said Charlotte wants to talk to me. I was really looking forward to climbing Teller's. Why should one accident close all the trails? What a wasted vacation. Yes. We're all suffering here. Steph asked me to pop by the record store if I had time. Visit the dispensary, yeah? I do that as first. Steph asked me to pop by the record store if I had time. Oh. It's that guy's sister. I feel so bad for her. Getting sick of people feeling bad for me. Still haven't found Mac. Jed suggested I check the flower shop. Too bad I can't just run away from all this. How's your progress in Moondrop Ranch? Did you buy your chicken coop? Go off the dude, look at Vince. Be a good time to check out the dispensary. Jed said Charlotte wants to talk to me. Finally, cancel. Yikes. Cancel. Yeah, a warning would have been nice. I think the trails will be closed for a while. Someone died up in the ravine a few days ago. Do you? You want? Oh, sorry. We met briefly. You're Gabe Chen's sister, right? Alex, yeah. I didn't know him well, but I could tell he had a big heart. I'm so sorry for your loss. Charlotte? Alex? Hey. Judd said you wanted to see me? I just wanted to see how you were doing. I'm okay. Keeping my chin up. Sometimes that's all you can do. How about you? I can't even imagine what you're going through. Honestly, I'm really trying to keep it together for Ethan. He's hurting. He does seem distant. He practically just lost a father. But he's shutting me out. He's never done that before. Not when it mattered. 
He's a pretty insightful kid. He knows how much you're hurting, even when you try to hide it from him. Instead of trying to be strong, maybe the best thing you can do is show him that it's okay to hurt. That's really helpful, Alex. Thank you. I can't get over the feeling that the one person who could help me deal with the aftermath of Gabe's death is Gabe. What is this? An affidavit from Typhon. If I sign, I'm agreeing not to press charges in exchange for a payment. A big one. That's so shady. Why would they be offering you money if they didn't do anything wrong? They say it's an offer of good faith, but you're right. He's dead because of them and I'd be letting them off. Are you gonna sign it? I don't know. I'm trying to put Ethan first, but... What would you do? Do you think it would be a betrayal of Gabe? you should sign it. I'm sorry. I know it's hard, but you can't let Typhon buy you off. Gabe made that call, and I'm gonna prove it. I just... I need some time. Thanks for being honest. If they're willing to pay Charlotte to keep quiet, they're definitely hiding something. Glass pipes are so cool. They're like works of art that can also get you high. I'm gonna figure out why Max lying. I really appreciate you stopping by. Feel free to take a look around if you want. I see why Gabe was so in love with her. I'm always here for you if you need anything. Thanks. Back at you. Of course, she's right. But I could really use that money. We can't give in, no matter how hard it is. Probably cost more than my bus ticket. And he did it all with one rusty saw and a bottle of gin. Impressive. God, put some clothes on. It blows my mind that Charlotte's been running the dispensary this whole time. I couldn't even leave the apartment. When did you start needing a PhD to smoke pot? Stairway to Haven? Believe it or not, Gabe named that one. Oh, I believe it. That's a Zemi. In the Dominican, they're said to house the spirits of gods. Mostly, I just like how it looks. It's really cool. I really love Charlotte's style. Sweet logo. Bet Charlotte designed it herself. There's nothing quite like a cup of weed on a cold day. Charlotte's dedication to her art is so inspiring. 
these bougie dispensaries are gonna put all the creepy dudes named Jean out of business. Given the circumstances, I could definitely go for a few of these. Man, these things better do the trick. I'm averaging like three hours a night. Pro tip, insomnia doesn't usually come from nowhere and THC is way better at treating it when you're also tackling the underlying cause. Any idea what's keeping you up? And which part of the brain is responsible for the crazy glowy feelies? Wonder what it's like to have I do my drugs out of a glass sculpture type of money. Still need to check the flower shop for Mac. Oh, so Record store. Was for Was for no. Steph asked me to pop by the record store if I had time. Steph asked me to swing by. She's got to be around here somewhere. Helpful. Looks like Steph might be working on a new project. Another issue of legendary monster hunter Thanor. Gabe was hoping I'd get back into playing. Maybe I will. Private mining interests will put their bottom lines before your family's health. You don't say. I might be too close to the issue to have an unbiased opinion, but fuck this. Val, I just want to be friends. Chrissy looks sweet. It would definitely be wrong to claim someone else's lost dog. Right? Breakup section, huh? That's rough, buddy. How could Chrissy leave me? After everything we've been through together. Chrissy. Wait, isn't that the name of the found dog? Hey, you posted about a lost dog, right? I think they have her over at Todd's Hardware. Are you serious? Uh, thank you so much. I I'll call them right now. Hi, I'm calling about the lost dog. Chrissy? Is she okay? Oh, thank God. I is she there now? Oh, awesome. Yes, thank you so much. Can I pick her up today? No sweat. Take your time. I'll wait. Thanks again. Me and Chrissy owe you one. You bet. Ninth Warden's cool, but not as cool as Thanor. Haven't listened to Firewalk in a while. I like their old stuff better anyway. I hope we all get to see more adventures of Thanor. I can't believe he ordered that record. Fuck. <laughs> I'm glad Gabe convinced her to stay. Haven's favorite, and only, choice for modern rock. Hey, I'm glad you stopped by. I've only got a sec, but... Have you talked to Ethan at all? T 
Hocked is maybe too strong a word. I tried. He's taking it really hard. But what you did for me this morning got me thinking. What if Ethan needs something like that too? Something fun and distracting. Something like a LARP. Like the one you and Gabe were gonna take him to? Yeah, but designed just for him and Thanor. He'll love that. Yeah, I'm glad you think so. I need your help though. I want it to be as good as it can be. Ethan gave you one of his comics, right? So, what do you think? Who would the famous monster slayer have the most fun defeating? Stormrather looks like a worthy opponent. He gets my vote. <laughs> All right, then. Oh, I, I gotta get back in there. There's some stuff in my comp book. Be cool if you could check it out. Help me make some calls. I'll see what I can do. Hey, uh, Haven listeners. That was Phone Tap with their new single, Elephant in the Room. We've got a sweet block of indie rock coming down the pike. But first, a few announcements. The spring Maybe I'll get to hear her play sometime. The mission is free this year, so bring your friends, bring your family. Still going. I'm sure it'll be different this time. Still need to check the flower shop for Mac. Fill in Steph's comp book. Oh, I can't do the full skip. Hey, uh, Haven listeners, that was Phone Tap with their new single, Elephant in the Room. I could take a minute to look through Steph's plans. Coming down the pike, but first, a few announcements. Fill in Steph's comic book. The Spring Festival is just. Oh. Looks like Steph wants me to do more than just make some decisions. She wants me to play a bard. This Guess I'm in. Let's start with my name. Is free this year, so bring your friends, bring your family. Hell, bring your ex. I'm sure it'll be different this time. There's beauty and simplicity. Ability time. Distortion field sounds fun, but healing serenade could really come in handy. Ah, healing fucking Healing serenade it is. How did I meet Thanor? It was a dark and stormy night. This LARP thing just might work. And I was.
still need to check the flower shop for Mac. Man, these overnight shifts really take it out of me. Yeah, my sleep schedule's fucked. Coffee in the morning, whiskey before bed. Works like a charm. I always figured mining was dangerous, but damn. I said Ethan when he was little. This whole thing is so horrible. There's literally nothing I can do for Ethan. I feel so useless. I've been there. Yeah, he looked rough. I didn't talk to him. Insert epiphany about new beginnings here. Ik was in de bloemenwinkel geweest, maar ik ben al lang vergeten waar het was. Eleanor? Oh! <gasps> Sorry. <laughs> no need to apologize. How are you, dear? Oh. I'm, um... Still just trying to adjust, I think. Give yourself some time. Change is always hard. Uh, is Mac here? Oh, he was helping me not too long ago. I think he just left. Can't have gotten too far. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> Thanks. Peace. Now, what was I? Oh, the hmm. limits. She looks terrified. I can't leave her like this. That guy is still bad to the gnome. <laughs> What's that? Oh, nothing. Just something funny Gabe said. That boy. Great things have small beginnings. Or something. Oh god, they're multiplying. What do you want? You want to make fun of me too, like those other jock assholes? What? No. You made a sick killer robot and won a fucking contest. That's. First of all, we got third place, and anyway. He's not a robot. Technically, he's... Ugh. God. Way to take the bait, Rai. You know what? Fuck those pricks. You rule. And I... would... really like to see your robot. If you want to show me. Gabe never did teach me how to ride a bike. Everyone wants an orchid until they realize how much work it takes to keep them alive. Kind of like fossils. They look like they have a really sweet relationship. Okay. Riley is officially a badass. I've definitely lived in uglier places.
that must have been a different time. Okay, what are we here? Figure out why she's afraid. How does she hide all of this? Oh, my memories, my memories are fading. I feel, I feel broken. broken. If they know if they about, know my, about condition, my condition, they'll make me close, make this, me place. close this place. The doctor said I had more time, but everything is becoming so out of order. If Riley, if Riley finds, finds out, out. She, can't she can't find out. Find out. just that she forgot what she was doing. She's afraid she's forgetting everything. But how can I help her? Forget what you were working on? <laughs> you could say I'm having a bit of a senior moment. <laughs> well, maybe I can help. Seems like you have a lot going on today. I could help you retrace your steps. Oh, uh, I don't want to keep you. <laughs> hey. I... I want to help. You must have flipped the sign to open. I always flip it first thing when I come in. And then I open my mail. Something must have distracted me. Better. We can do this. You were over here when I came in. Maybe you were counting the drawer. I would have done that last night. Oh. Did you trim these flowers today? 
You don't have to do this. I'll be all right on my own. Okay, it is. Hey, I'm not going anywhere. Did anything happen with Riley? I... I don't know. Could a phone call have distracted you? Yes. I got a call first thing in the morning. But I can't think who it was. Maybe we can find something to remind you. Could it have been Riley who called? I think that's right. She called to tell me about a new order. Oh, goodness. What was the order for? order. This must be what Riley came in for. I think that order might have been for these lilies. Of course. Riley helped me pick them out before she left. Now we just have to figure out who ordered them. The check for the lilies would be in here, right? That could tell us who bought them. It should. Mr. Jedediah Lucan. Huh. Looks like the lilies are for Jed. That's right. Riley dropped off an order for Jed. I knew you'd figure it out. I couldn't have done it without you. Seriously, Alex, you're a godsend. Jed must be hosting some event. I wonder why he wants lilies, though. They're traditionally for funerals. God, she doesn't remember. They were... They were for Gabe's wake. Gabe's wake? Gabe's wake? I... Missed it. Sorry. Hey, it's um... Excuse me. Fucking hell. Now I have to think Okay. That sucked. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But at least I told her the truth. She's really hurting, but I didn't want to lie to her. That poor young man. How did I forget? I'm so sorry, Eleanor. I hope it's good news. Eleanor said Mac is nearby. I don't see him here. Maybe at the bridge?
Search for Mac near the flower shop. Time to get the truth. I'm so fucked. Can't hide from me forever, Mac. Hey, Mac. Mac. Alex. Look, it's not a good time. You owe me an explanation about what happened to Gabe. I'm really sorry he died. And I appreciate that you... You didn't out me to Riley the other night, but I can't talk to you. I get it. He died on your shift, and you're freaked. But you have to come clean. Please. There's nothing I can tell you. Mac, come on. He was my big brother. He was my love. I can't. I can't. I can't. Something definitely has him scared. Maybe if I could tap into his fear, I could get to the truth. Tap into his fear? I just need to find something I could use to push him over the edge. Time to get the truth. Everyone's out to get me. Alex, Ryan, even Riley. Fuck! Even Riley? Did something happen with her? I have to go to Riley. Yes. Yeah. What the fuck is that now? To you. Let it go. That's rough. If I tell him I like him, we'll date, and then we'll break up, and then I'll lose my best friend. Hmm. Maybe I could help them. Wait, hell no. What am I thinking? This is none of my business. Help. Help. Come on, man. Can't you take a hint? She's not into you. Let it go. Guess they didn't feel like painting the mine. Simple but effective. What could be back there? Damn, maybe there's something around here I can use to get it open. Broken into places for less. Yee, and 
I cannot stress this enough. Ha. Maybe Riley knows something I can use against Mac. If he's innocent, why is he acting like this? Acting like what? Maybe I can get her to tell me. Hey, Riley. Alex. Hey. You and Eleanor seem close. She's taken care of me ever since I was little. I never really knew my mom, but she's always been there for me. What does she think about you going away to school? She's thrilled. <laughs> I think she just wants me to end up happy. That's really sweet. She's the most selfless person I know. I know having you work with her in the shop has meant the world. Yeah. To both of us. I know you and Gabe were close. How are you doing? I miss him. So much. like an older brother to me. I'm glad you had him. He was a really good guy, Alex. That fight Mac had with Gabe over your secret meetings. They were about you applying to college, right? Yeah. Ever since the first time Mac lost his shit in front of them, Gabe and Charlotte had tried to get me to end things with him. And after all this, I can see that they were right. Do you think he could have ignored Gabe's call? I mean, do you think he's capable of that? I don't want to believe that, but... Sorry. I'm really not ready to talk about it. Yeah. I get it. It's just... If he didn't do anything wrong, why is he acting like he has something to hide? He asked me to leave Haven with him. What? Right after the wake. He wouldn't tell me why. But he just looked so guilty. I told him I had to think about it, but... Alex, I... I'm scared. He did something horrible. Riley... Thank you for telling me. You deserve the truth. I gotta run. There's some stuff I need to do. Okay. okay. We'll talk soon? Yeah. Whenever you want. Mac trying to skip town is sketchy as shit. I bet I could use that to stoke his fear. Thanks for spending time with me. Thanks for letting- I can't believe Mac asked her to leave with him. If he's innocent, why is he acting like this? Sorry, Riley. I don't think he's innocent.
I should make sure there's nothing else I want to do before I confront Mac. I like a lot of spots. What Riley told me might do it, but I should make sure there isn't anything I still want to do around town first. Yeah, let's go. Okay, let's do this. I got Riley to tell me about your plans to leave town. That's not something innocent people do. Oh God. It's not... I didn't do anything. <sighs> Fuck off! <sighs> Leave me alone! Deal with Mac when I get to him. For now, I need to learn everything I can. Typhon's always watching. They run this whole town. Mac feels like everyone's staring at him. Everyone thinks I killed him. They all hate me. Killed my loser. What? It's not fair. I didn't do anything wrong. instead. Alex? Wow. <laughs> no! What the hell? There are people out there! No, I told you to call it off! I saw the way they looked at me at the wake. They all think I let him die. I know why you're lying. Typhon's forcing you to deny the call. What the fuck? I know you tried to stop it. They fucked up, not you. Stop lying for them! You don't get it. This wasn't some accident. I told them you were down there, and they detonated anyway. On purpose? Why? I don't know. I swear. And then I get a message telling me to deny there was ever a call. You gotta believe me. Cave and I, we didn't get along, but I, I didn't want him dead. And now, now Typhon's watching me. My girlfriend, she, she thinks I'm a murderer? My neighbors all hate me? What, what, what the fuck am I supposed to do? I think I can calm him down, but does he deserve it? Fucking hell. 
All right, Mac. Come on. You gotta calm down, okay? Dude, stay with me. I know what it's like to be doubted. To have everyone think the worst of you. But the truth will come out. I'll make sure of it. But Typhon... If Typhon comes after you, they're gonna have to get through me too, okay? feel a little better. <laughs> yeah, well, you learn a thing or two hanging out with shrinks your whole life. <laughs> so, what are you gonna do now? Don't leave Haven. I'm gonna get to the truth. Hey. Yeah, it's... Can we talk? Where are you? Okay. You were right. About Typhon, about Mac. I got so Alex. Like that. It... Mac got the call. How do you know that? He got the call and he lied about it. Doesn't matter. Someone is putting pressure on him to keep quiet. Someone from the mine and... It doesn't matter! I keep... Coming here and playing it back. But it always ends the same. Ryan. He's dead. He's really dead, Alex. Suicide is not the answer. my fault. My job is to keep people safe. And I failed. Ryan. I owe you my life. She's wrong. I let her cross that log. I put Gabe in harm's way. I'm not a hero. 
worse than worthless. I know what it's like to feel worthless and helpless, but we saved Ethan, and you saved me. It doesn't matter. Gabe's dead because of me. Gabe, I'm so sorry. Oh, nay. Oh, God. Oh, nay. <laughs> Gabe loved you, Ryan. He would forgive you. You know that. You're not alone. gorilla suit? <laughs> Does he also jump off of the cliff and into the pool? No, no. He chases a guy in a banana suit. That guy jumps <laughs> off the cliff and into the pool. Okay, I'm, I'm sorry. This is a Mexican restaurant? Eh, nominally. <laughs> <laughs> the food is, uh, well, terrible. But it's Gabe's favorite place. <laughs> I tell you, he's the oldest 12-year-old I know. you something? Of course. You came up here to tell me that I was right about Mac. About him getting a call. How did you know? There's something you should know about me. And it's going to be easier to show you than to explain it. This is going to seem sort of weird at first, then really weird. Do you trust me? What is a good one? Scary work will probeer, Okay. Think of something that just scares the shit out of you. Really focus. Until you feel it. You're afraid you won't know how to handle it without Gabe. Never knew anyone so good at getting into and out of trouble. <laughs> oh, man, this one time. Whatever it is you're thinking about right now, don't stop, okay? Keep going. Okay. <laughs> what emotion is this? Be a good 
good memory. I wonder if I can piece it together. Okay. <laughs> Gabe. Goose. I see it. It'll move. It's not moving. It'll move. Gabe! How deep you think? Deeper than that. If the Royal Canadian Mounted Police can spot a goose grave at a hundred paces... The Mounties? Oh, come on, man! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. How long were you gonna let me dig? Well, I wasn't gonna stop you. <laughs> Oh, that's a lot of blood, huh? Gabe, this is serious. Killing a Canadian <laughs> goose is a violation of international law. <laughs> Shut up. It is not. They're Canadian geese, Gabe. Property of the crown. The... the crown of... Property of the crown, Gabe. What do we do? <laughs> so... <laughs> did you finish burying the goose or not? Okay, also, property of the crown? <laughs> really? <laughs> well, they are technically protected under the Migratory Bird Treaty Act. <laughs> <laughs> How? So... I guess I have this power. I can see other people's emotions. They show up like an aura, and if I get too close, I, I feel what they feel, as if I was feeling it myself. And when I focus, I can even understand why they're feeling it. And that's what you just did with... with me? Whew. Some kind of power. No kidding. It's... it's only ever been the bad emotions before, but... That, that was pure joy. Who else knows? My brewer, what is that? Gabe did. But now I guess just you. And that's how I know Max terrified of Typhon. He reported Gabe's call, and they ignored it. Now they're putting pressure on him to tow the line. Okay, but... why? I don't know yet. Someone made the decision to let the blast go off. Seems like finding out who would be a good start. So, you're going after Typhon? You'll need help. You don't have to. You're stuck with me now. You're welcome, I guess. Yeah. Thanks. Thank you. No. Thank you.
This one's for you, Gabe. I miss you. speak this morning. I couldn't. Hearing everyone talk about him, about the life he had here with all of you, I lost the chance to have that. But even though I only had one day with him, he changed my life. said, I didn't know if I belonged here. He told me that home isn't something you find. It's something you build. Episode 2. Oké, okay, heel veel percentage. Alex reminder Eleanor about what happened. Ook hoog. Shall it didn't take. Ja. Yeah. Oh, sign the agreement after Alex didn't visit her. Huh. Enjoy it quiet moment on the dock. Put the album after put the photograph on games. Left the happy face. Oh, we're weinig. Alex chose to go by Alexandra in the LARP. Alex, at the moment, think of Gabe. Alex admitted she didn't hear the. Okay, this. Ik ben weinig. Offer training. Forgiveness. Ja. Yeah. Ryan is to forgive himself. Ryan accept. Oh, okay. Share a hug. Logisch. Ik liet, ik liet Steph winnen, dat is 100%. Alex didn't talk to Steph in the record store. Oh, 1%. Damn. Alex didn't help the bird watcher. Oh, ik wist niet dat hij dat, dat, dat elkaar kon helpen. Nou, dat was uh, chapter 2. Ik, ik hoop dat je van genoten hebt. Peace.